with banners that read Black Lives Matter, Justice for Moise, and Immigrants Matter, thousands of protesters took to the streets of several Brazilian cities on February 5th. They were out on the streets to demand justice for Moise Cabangawe, a migrant worker living in Rio de Janeiro who was murdered on January 24th. The demonstrations were organized by migrant communities, collectives, and popular movements. Participants who took place in the protests in nine states denounced precarious work, racism, and xenophobia against immigrants. Como negros brasileiros, a gente sabe o peso do genocídio contra o nosso povo, o peso do extermínio que o nosso povo sofre constantemente. Só que esse é mais do que isso, né? Um caso também de xenofobia muito explícita, em que um imigrante congolês foi assassinado da mesma forma que os negros brasileiros são constantemente assassinados. É, a gente está aqui hoje para pedir a justiça para o governo brasileiro, porque esse caso é muito constrangedor. É um cara que foi trabalhado honestamente com o salário dele, e não pagaram e mataram ele. Então poderia ser eu também. 24-year-old Moise Kabangawe, a Congolese migrant, was found dead on January 24th after being beaten to death in Rio de Janeiro. Kabangawe had gone to the Tropicalia kiosk in the Barra de Tijuca beach to collect payment for working two days as a kitchen helper, according to family members. In response, men from the kiosk beat him for 15 minutes until his death. Kabangawe was found on a ladder, tied up, and already dead by the time police arrived. Family members only found out about the death on Tuesday morning, January 25th, almost 12 hours after the crime. A man who claimed to have participated in the murder turned himself into the police on February 1st. On the same day, the government of the state of Rio de Janeiro announced that it will suspend the operation permit of the Tropicalia kiosk. The city government of Rio de Janeiro has since announced that it will transform the kiosk into a memorial to Moise and African culture. The owner of the kiosk has not yet been released and is expected to give a statement to the police on Tuesday. In a joint note, Caritas de Rio de Janeiro, the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, and the International Organization for Migration detailed how Moise arrived in Brazil as a child, accompanied by his brothers. Once in the country, he and his family were recognized as refugees by the Brazilian government. The embassy of the Democratic Republic of the Congo said that they are in contact with Moise's family, who are demanding a statement from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. The embassy is also demanding answers from the Brazilian government regarding investigations into other Congolese migrants killed in the country.